Hi everyone, Richard from DIYRollerBinds.net.au. We're going to show you how to install a roller bind. Each roller blind will come with mounting screws, brackets, chain holder and a chain stopper. The tools required for this step are a Phillips head screwdriver, a 2.5mm drill bit, a pencil, a pliers and masking tape may be required. First, we're going to sit our brackets in and mark where we're going to drill the hole through. Mark both sides. When it comes to installing your roller blind brackets, there are two sides. Make sure you install the control side on the control side. When you order your roller blind, you're going to choose which side you want the control on. That could be a chain or a motor. And this side is your pin. Get your roller blind inside the bracket. You need to turn the cog to pull the pin in. One thing to note, when you are installing the roller blind, make sure the chain is facing downwards. Now what we're going to do is we're going to test the roller blind and make sure that it goes down and up straight. Now what we're looking for here, we're going to wind it all the way out until you see the masking tape and then we're going to roll it, roll it up slowly. What we're looking for is these side gaps to make sure the roller blind is not moving to one side. As you can see here, this one is rolling a little bit to the right here. You can see that it's tapered off here, which means it's pulling to the right hand side. What we need to do now is use our masking tape. If your fabric is moving to that side, then we need to put a little bit of masking tape on this side to help it come this way. Gonna test rolling that up. As you can see now, the fabric is not hitting the cog and the fabric is not hitting the control. Just give it a couple of goes up and down. Make sure it's winding up straight. That's pretty good. We're gonna install the chain stopper now, which is this small plastic ball that was supplied with your roller blind. What you need to do is you need to move the roller blind, get that base rail as close to the bottom where you want the roller blind to stop. You're gonna grab the ball closest to the control and install the chain stopper. Squeeze that over the ball like so. What this is going to do is this is potentially going to stop your roller blind from over rolling and falling off the tube. We're now going to install the chain holder. There are two different types of installations for the chain holder depending if you are installing it on the inside or the outside. For inside, you're going to install it just to the inside of your reveal there. For an outside mount, you'll be installing it to the fascia. Now when you install this, don't put too much tension on it. Give it a little bit of play. Now we're just gonna mark it there. You can't get a pencil in there, so use a screw. Pre-drill. Test it out. And you're done. If you're installing your roller binds on the outside, you're gonna fix them to the outside edge. Try and line it up as straight as you can with your architraves. If you're installing a double bracket, like so, you're gonna fix that up 
on the underneath side, or if we're installing it on the outside, you're gonna mark and fix straight through the front. 